Saturday, February 17th, 2024. So uh, we were gone for a week, so I got didn't get a whole lot done. So we you know started on the rear fuselage. Side panels are on. Um, just tricky getting everything lined up and making sure to get full penetration on the rivets because it's critical back here. Ran rudder cables and I've got my fair lead nylon rub guards on both sides installed. That's actually not on the plans, but uh, talking with others, they're supposed to go mounted on the outside. Um, side skins, you know, just took some time. Now I'm dry fitting the luggage extension as well as the luggage floor area, the luggage bulkhead. Um, I did have the floor in here all clecoed in, so make sure everything was all matched up. Um, took it all out because I'm going to put foam on the bottom over here. I've got those areas marked off. So I'll foam that for insulation purposes and soundproofing. And then uh, start putting this all together. I've got these stringers all riveted in, including on the side piece here for this cross member. And let's see, okay, rudder cables are in. So we're taking a look at the fair lead here. You got one that's higher than the other, and that's just to keep the two from interfering because they do cross. I don't know if you can see or not, but when you add tension to these, when you add tension to these rudder cables, can't see it now, but they do cross, and so one's higher than the other, so they don't rub. And then you can adjust everything here, and then in the floor, there's actually an inspection port that you can open to fine tune that and I think that's about it for right now I'll finish riveting together the floor for the luggage area and the luggage extension so that will be all locked in and riveted and be going on to the next portion so the foam is installed at the bottom of the luggage floor and uh, just use this uh, just took some poster board, got it at the dollar store, and used that as a template. Worked out pretty well. Did the bottom of the inspection hatch doors, and went ahead and wrapped the luggage extension compartment. Doesn't have to look pretty, because no one's gonna see it. And I'm actually, I don't think the plan's called to do that, but so that, that required me using more foam than what the kit offers. So I did order some more foam. So the luggage floor, the luggage bulkhead, and the luggage extension have all been installed. And it was a little trickier than I thought because, and this just speaks to the precision of this kit. There was a few times where I thought something's not lining up. Oh, well, maybe I'll just drill it to make it fit and I said eh, it doesn't feel right so I didn't I took it back apart I took that floor out probably half a dozen times until I got everything lined up and then once it all came together um, it really fits perfectly and it just you know you have to get these ribs in and out in the front this this front channel here uh, I got to push on that a little bit to get the holes to line up but once everything lines up it really does come together so there there is that and the next thing is going to be installed will be the shoulder harness strap and then the parachute box which goes over here which is that what that's what that black line is just didn't rivet those areas there because that's where the parachute box goes so onward and upward the rear fuselage is about as complete as I want to take it right now. So these are the things that um, I've done so far is seat belt restraints are in, a little bit of soundproofing on the uh, luggage extension. And you can see that this is the, the parachute box and the cable tray, the parachute cable tray has been installed. And this right here is the, the rocket tube and the floor is installed. 
Um, so that's really everything right now. So I'll start working on the center fuselage. Um, I'm gonna leave the top skins off. I still have some wiring to do. I need to run some wire for uh, the, the, the beacon as well as the trim tab actuator and the static lines, um, GPS antennas, all those things are left. So, um, so I'm gonna be doing that at a later time. So next will be the center fuselage.